New York is so gross. It's the only city where water falls on you and you're like, that could be anything. <laughs> At this point, I'm like, I hope it's just pee. <laughs> I give money to a homeless man and my friend was like, real New Yorkers don't give money to the homeless. Real New Yorkers are homeless. <laughs> I was walking down the street. Somebody told me to go back to where I come from. I'm just white and gay. Like this guy thinks that there's a country. <laughs> where gay people come from? Which means he knows about Canada. <laughs> Another friend told me I code switch, which is where you talk differently to fit in. And I was like, nah, you tripping. I see it. <laughs> Of course I code switch, like I can't even disagree with hot people, you know, it's like, like, yeah, like one time I was having sex with this guy and I am gay by the way, and he was like, what? With that cropped blouse? And he was like, are you into water sports? I didn't know what that was, but he was, he was really hot. So I said, that's my favorite. And then he peed on me and I just, and then I just had to look up at him and be like, oh good, it's my favorite. Thank you, thank you, Papa. And here's the thing: there's when you're when someone's peeing on you. There's just, <laughs> there's never there's like <laughs> there's not a good mo you know there's not a window to be like actually you know this is gonna sound crazy. I just remembered I don't like being peed on. Bye. Thank you. I did not enjoy it, but it cleared my head. I was being peed on like I should go back to school. <laughs> <laughs> so he, here's the weirdest part is he wasn't standing above me to pee on to me. Like, you know, you should. He, I don't know why I put it. He, he was, <laughs> but he was, lay, he was lying down next to me. Oh. Yeah, that O is exactly, <laughs> that's for the rest of you. Well, geometrically, let's figure that out together. You know, like, so he was here, I was here. He aimed the dick with, you know what I mean? With like the right angle of the penis and power of the stream of the pee. You know, so he could, so that he could like parabola the pee. <laughs> Onto, onto my face. Cause it's sort of like on a, in Angry Birds, you know, you gotta like, right? And then from my perspective, pee is just coming from nowhere. Just sky pee? Now that's a trigger. Every time it rains, I'm like, not now, Todd. <laughs> and then this is true. After he asked, he asked if uh, I let people eat on my bed. <laughs> I was like, now I do. <laughs> How crazy would it be if I was like, I don't want to get crumbs on the pee. It's good pee. Um, do you guys remember the family computer? <laughs> I, one computer, the whole family shared it. And I didn't realize it until later, I think my whole family masturbated in the same chair. <laughs> And I would, <laughs> I'd watch porn on the family computer. I'd watch gay porn. I'm gay, by the way. And under, <laughs> with those pleated jeans? No, he's not. And under, <laughs> underneath, this, in, underneath the gay porn, in case somebody walked in, I had straight porn. <laughs> you know what I should have hid my gay porn with? Instead of straight, any, anything else, anything else. Anything else. That'd be like if I was shooting up heroin. But just in case mom walks in, I have an ordinary line of cocaine that's ready to go. Also, like, what was the plan? You know, like, my mom walks in on me, and then, like, what? I quickly exit out of a browser, and she's like, what are you watching? And I'm like, what am I watching? <laughs> Pussy. <laughs> you caught me. Oh, no. Oh, I guess you're gonna have to tell everybody at school about your pussy-loving son. <laughs> now I fuck bears? <laughs> yes, I love saying that because all the queer people are always like, yes! And then the straight people are like... <laughs> are we doing Are we doing that? Is that I swear it gets harder to be an ally every day. <laughs> No, it's a, it's a queer community, so it's bears, it's a, a bigger guys. You know, I like a belly, I love a belly. Another, um, another way to say it, I'm diabetic. My type is type one, but my type is type two. <laughs> that is my best joke, so like, take your time. Um, really do the math, I feel like it's worth it, you know? 
I just like, I've, sorry I've never been having sex with a guy and been like, yeah, he's hot, but like, what do his bones feel like? <laughs> you guys like bones? Why do you like bones so much? You fucking love bones? This is weird. Like, call me a chubby chaser, I'll call you a golden retriever. Go fetch your bones. <laughs> Go get your bones, you Chalamet obsessed perverts. Like, give me a belly. I love a belly. Sam, that's creepy. What do you do with a belly? What do you do with tits? I have no idea. Like, I, I, what, I, I don't, I think it's the same thing. You stare at him and go, nice. <laughs> I'm a fan. <laughs> you know, also like creepy, at least. Bellies don't have eyes. <laughs> no, there's a lot of contradictions here. Straight guys love huge tits. What's a belly but the single biggest tit ever? <laughs> Yo, Sam, check out her double Ds. Check out his single Q. <laughs> It's like, sorry, I've never seen a huge dick and been like, no, I want two tiny dicks. Rallies <laughs> <laughs> are just so sexy. It's a big fucking. I'll say it right here, right now, belly is the new ass. Believe me or don't, in 10 years, the watermelon emoji is gonna be huge. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln was gay. Did you know that? Yes. It's true, he had, a se he had a secret lover, a secret gay lover, a senator. His name was Joshua Speed. They wrote love letters to each other. One of them said, my heart yearns for you, comma, romantically. Aww. Another one said, you up. Also, his wife's name was Mary Todd. That's literally what he wanted to do. <laughs> you know? I, so I, I kind of think everyone was gay back then because back then men wore heels and wigs and makeup. That was the standard of masculinity. The manliest men, they wore heels. Think about that. He, they, imagine it. If George Washington were here today, RuPaul would take one look at him like, we need that queen on the show. <laughs> Look at her! I mean, legs for days, be to the god. Sure, she doesn't have teeth, but honey, she has charisma. <laughs> They'd have a whole season, obviously called Founding Daddies. <laughs> and now the rules of masculinity are so different. There's a lot of rules, you know, they're, they're chaotic. They don't make any sense. You, you, to be man, to not be called gay. You know what I mean? Like you, gotta, like you can wear watches, but you can't wear earrings because time is straight, but sound is gay. <laughs> Short shorts are gay, but long shorts are straight, but capris are gay, pants are straight, pantsuits are lesbian, and theater is gay, but if you're in your underwear, it's wrestling. <laughs> I can't follow these rules, there's too many rules. I don't have to, I'm free, I can do this. You know, you know, like, why is this so gay? Why is that so, just a limb extend, it's just a limb, it's just that? Like, why is fully extending your limbs just the gayest thing you, why is this so gay? Like, why is that so, that's, that's the gayest thing, but limbs are for everybody, we should be able to extend them. I'm worried about straight men, because if you don't use it, you lose it, like, that's how evolution works, and in, I think in five million years, straight men are not gonna have arms. <laughs> or buttholes, and you're just sort of, well, if you want them, use them. What do you think they're there for? Put a finger up there, figure it out, it's not decor. Or you're gonna lose them, and then in five million years, you're just sort of gonna be just waddling around, just begging gay men to get things on high shelves. And we're gonna do it, because we're gonna have 50 arms, because we used them, they're gonna be dicks. We're gonna be helicopters, flying above you guys, singing show tunes, and you're gonna wanna dance, but you can't because you never anally masturbated and now you're pooping out of your mouth. <laughs> Any questions or? <laughs> and that's why belly is the new ass. And fuck Dylan Adler. I'm Sam Morrison. Good night. <laughs>